It is Tea Maker time. Hello everyone, hope you're doing great. Tea Maker about the new the young driver in Formula One. It's gonna be quite uh, tricky to position everyone because there's these categories and there's drivers and it's just, uh, yeah, just not, not gonna be so easy, but I'm gonna try to do the best I can. Obviously, I wanna see yours as well. Uh, I wanna see what you think. A little surprise at the end of the video once we've positioned everyone. So let's go and let's try. All right, Pierre Gasly. Pierre Gasly, we got can score points, can win a GP. Done that is score points. Can win multiple GP. Can be the top one team. Can be world champion legend. I think I'm gonna put Pierre Gasly in. Can win multiple GP. He has had his chance with Red Bull. Didn't really go well. He's won a GP uh, for Alpha Tori, and hopefully if he's got the car, I think he can win more GP. So Pierre Gasly can win multiple GP. Then we have Mr. Zhu, new young driver, new drivers. Difficult to know right now what he can do, right? So. I'm I'm just gonna be uh, putting him for now as as a simply simple way of putting in in can score points. Then we've got Esteban Ocon. Esteban Ocon has already won a GP. I think he's gonna go with Pierre Gasly. Can win multiple GP. They're very similar, uh, very talented drivers, but they're not uh, in a top team yet. Esteban has signed a long time a long term contract with Alpine, so I think he can win multiple GP, and I hope he will. Uh, Lance Stroll. I think I'm gonna put Lance at can score points, good points. It's shown that he can do that. Aston Martin, a little bit up and down. Got the partnership with Mercedes that worked really well the first year, but the last two years have been a little bit more complicated. Lance is very fast on the wet, very impressive. So I think he can score some really good points. Then we got Lando Norris. Lando Norris is uh, one of the really good surprises of the last few years. Very impressive driver, very fast, very consistent, can get the most of his car. I hope it Lando can put can be top favorite in in a top team so lando in a top team number one in a top team oh then <laughs> side by side with charles leclerc and max verstappen they can both be a formula one legend there is no doubt about it max is already pretty much up there first one to beat lewis hamilton after so many years and getting red bull back at the top so max definitely Charles, uh, bright for with Ferrari. Obviously, it all depends on Ferrari, but I believe if you win with Ferrari, if he's the one delivering that championship that Ferrari's been waiting for so long, he's definitely gonna be uh, gonna be a legend. So I'm gonna put them up there right now. So Max and Charles can be world champion legend. And then with Mick Schumacher. Mick Schumacher, early days, tough season 2021 from the car. He's no next to Kevin Magnussen. I think he can get a lot of experience uh, from that. So I'm gonna put Mick, I don't know, it really depends which team is going next. So for now, I'm gonna put him in, can, go, can score good points and hopefully then, you know, he can step up to a better team and can win a GP or multiple GP. But for now, I'm gonna just put him in, can score good points. Niklas Latifi is with Williams. Uh, Williams is, is having a tough time, so I can't really put him anywhere yet just because, you know, he doesn't have the car and hasn't really be able to, um, to show what he can do. George Russell with Mercedes. I mean, can be in a more top team. He's done, he's done that. He's in, a, he's in the number one top team. So I think I'm going to put George with Max and Charles. I believe, you know, he's got great chance to be the next generation for Mercedes, to learn from Lewis and to do great stuff. I've got a huge respect for George and I think he's, he's super hyper fast. So yeah, I'm going to put George up there. And then finally, Yuki Tsunoda. I'm gonna put Yuki and can win a GP because Yuki, I really like him. I really like his style. Obviously the first year in Formula One, the first race everyone was like, is the new hero, is the new hero. That is tough in Formula One because you get under so much pressure that and he didn't really perform the way it should have. Lucky for him, he's got a second chance with uh, Alfa Tauri next to Pierre Gasly. So this year is the year where he does have to uh, step up and do some, you know, be equal with Pierre. But I believe in Yuki, I think he's fast, I think he's talented, I think he's got something special, so I'm gonna put him at can win a GP. So now it's your turn, show me what you got, show me yours. Right, surprise, if we get to 10,000 like on that video, we're gonna do a live together, a live on YouTube, but that's only if we get to 10,000 like. So make sure that you like, subscribe, you follow us, uh, you, may, you leave a comment, and then as always, I'll be reading, I'll be behind, and I will respond with the next video.